Hey, what's going on guys? I'm trying to reconnect my HP wireless printer. It's an HP NV6055E and I just want to do wireless and I totally forgot how to reconnect the wireless feature. So in order to do this, I'm going to show you first of all where the wireless button is to turn on and off. So let me pull this sideways. You can use USB if you want. It did not come with the USB cable. I don't know why. That is the power button. There is the power plug. This is the wireless button that you need to press to turn the Wi-Fi on. All right, so now what you need to do is you need to hold it in for three seconds. One, two, three. Now you should see a blue light go purple. Now that you see a purple light showing, now it's ready to pair or sync with your phone or your laptop. I'm going to use my laptop. Okay. And I would download the, recommend downloading the HP Smart app or program to your computer. Okay, so you're gonna to need to press this plus button on the HP Smart app slash program. It's gonna search for your printers. Make sure that the printer is glowing purple. It needs to be glowing purple. That means it is in sync mode or pair mode. And there it is. HP NV6000 setup. Time to connect, set up, and manage. Again, this is all wireless. I'm not doing any wired connection. Continue. Now it's asking for my Wi-Fi password. It can also do it automatically. So I'm doing the automatic selection. If you don't know what your password is, usually it's on the back of your router unless you customized your own password. Press the flashing information button on your printer. So now I'm going over to the printer, pressing the flashing icon. Wi-Fi icon is flashing, it is blue, and that is good news. Sounds like it's connected, waiting for the screen, and boom, it is connected. We are wireless with the HP NV6000 series, whichever one you have. Printer offline should now say printer online. I just moved into my new home and I totally forgot how to reconnect my printer and then I realized that you need to hold that Wi-Fi button on the back of the printer for three seconds until you see a purple flashing light. And now as you see, that is a solid light blue color and that's what it should be. So let's go ahead and do a test print. And there we go, again, I am wireless. And looks like we're good. As long as it printed out and it says network status ready, Wi-Fi good, we're good to go. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.